My name is Evgeny Vashukevich, and we offer uh, you a course on the physical basics of quantum computation, developed at the Laboratory of Quantum Optics at St. Petersburg State University. Quantum computations has been a hot topic for researchers around the world for many years. During the 40 years of their existence, a long way from the work of Yuri Manin to and Richard Feynman, in which the basic principles of such calculations were proposed, to real physical devices in which these principles were confirmed during the physical experiment, has been passed. However, many issues still remain unsolved and open. And in particular, it is still unclear whether it is possible to create a so-called quantum computer that is a special device that will be able to perform a special set of algorithms based on the application of quantum mechanical effects, which will allow to achieve significantly greater performance in comparison with existing classical algorithms. In our course, we'll try to tell you in detail about quantum mechanical effects and how they can be used to create quantum algorithms. In particular, attention will be paid to the concept of separability of quantum systems and quantum entanglement. We'll look at the way quantum entanglement can be used to transmit information using examples of superintendence encoding and teleportation protocols. And then we'll consider such phenomena as quantum parallelism and quantum interference, on the basis of which most known quantum algorithms are developed. We also consider the algorithms of Deutsch and Shor that have already become classic examples of quantum algorithms. In the end, we'll talk a little about the quantum theory of error correction, which is necessary to create scalable, that is, consistent of large number of logical operations, quantum computing. In our course, we'll introduce all the concepts and definitions from quantum mechanics and quantum information theory that is necessary for us. We will discuss the concepts of pure in mixed states and pay special attention to the latter, since they pay respect to religion attention in classical textbooks on quantum mechanics. And also, we will recall the basics of quantum theory. The knowledge of the basics of linear algebra and mathematical analysis are preliminary requisites for our course. Also, in our lessons, we will need an understanding of some subjects of optics and electricity and mag magnetism. However, if something turns out to be unfamiliar for you, in, in the supporting material we will provide links to the necessary literary resources. All authors of the course are interested in your understanding and complete picture of the ideas of the quantum theory of computation so that you understand how quantum algorithms work. To do this, we have prepared tests and exercises that we hope will help you master this difficult but quite an interesting topic. We hope that our course will be really useful for you, and we will be grateful for, for your feedback, comments, and suggestions. The whole team of authors and I personally wish you good luck in mastering the course Physical Basics of Quantum Computation.